Hello guys and welcome back to another Clash Royale video. So today I will be playing Skeleton Giant Raid Challenge and in this challenge I am using this deck. So you can see that this is a 2.6 variant. I have replaced Ice Golem uh, with uh, Skeleton Giant as it's mandatory to use a Skeleton Giant in this challenge at, as it will be raised up. So I am at the 7 wins guys. I have already won 7 matches and now I only need to play 3 more matches to win the emote as they are giving away an emote in this challenge. So let's do it guys. So the plan will be like this. We will not use our skeleton giant until they use their skeleton. So we must be ready for that. So now you can see that he, he has just used his skeleton giant. So I will put down mine. In lot of matches I saw that most of the people are using a skeleton giant as a winning condition and uh, they are not using any alternate win condition with that a few players are using a uh, skeleton giant with royal giant and with hog so this can be a very good combo with uh, royal giant and hog and even you can use it with the uh, graveyard so you can consider these decks uh, playing in this challenge okay so now I will wait for Elixir to fill and then I will start with my attack. So I think my dog also want to do the voiceover with me. Okay, so guys, uh, I'm starting with Hog attack. So sending Hog to his weak side tower. He used his wizard and tombstone. So I will fireball his wizard to get some value. As I know that he just used 8 Elixir to defend my hog so here i will use my skeleton giant like this as i want to take out his wizard first and then it will take out his skeleton giant uh, now i don't have elixir so i will not support my skeleton giant as it's already half dead so here i will defend his electro with my spirit and skelly okay so after filling the elixir i will attack with my hog so here I'm going in with my hog attack. So he is putting down his elite bug. I will put down my cannon and then I will log his elite. Okay, so he also have goblin barrel. Okay, so this is going to be a very weird deck guys. So he have a goblin barrel, he have a skeleton giant. Okay, so here I will take out his uh, tombstone using my musky. Okay, so he put down his uh, skeleton giant, so I will also put down mine. Here I will log his wizard and tombstone, and then I will go in with my hog attack. Okay, so he used his elite, so I think he will go with his barrel, and here I will fireball his barrel. Okay, okay, so he is putting down his tombstone as he was trying to predict my hog okay here i will put down my skeleton giant so here i want to go in with my hog and for that i have to take out his tombstone first so let's see guys okay here i will lock his tombstone and then i will go in with my hog so here i will also do a prediction fireball and i will hit uh, elite and our hog got two shot out of it which is very good and uh, now i think we just need two fireballs to finish the match here first i will defend his skeleton giant it's not electro giant sorry guys so it's a skeleton giant and then i will start my fireball cycle guys okay so here i will go in with my horn okay so here you can see that my skeleton giant has connected to his left side tower and hog also connected on the right side so ggs to him guys uh, as i did finish the match with a fireball so ggs to him and i'm two matches away from winning the emote so here i will jump into the next match guys and let's see which deck we are gonna face so it will surely contain a wrench uh, a rage sorry it's not wrench a rage skeleton giant okay so i'm going in with my skelly at the back so he also did the same it cannot be a mirror match so i will wait a little bit and then i will put down my skeleton giant why i did that is uh, the reason behind this is guys uh, i want his skeleton giant to cross the bridge and here i will fireball his archer queen as well here i misclicked the log 
as I'm sure that I didn't ne need that log as Archer Queen must have been taken out by the bomb. Okay, so here I will go in with my hog and then let's see guys what he will do. I think our hog will get one shot surely. Okay, so I will not use any card. I will wait for Elixir to fill. I think he will get some damage but it will be okay guys. Like We can take this damage. Here I will go with my Electro Spirit and then I will put down my cannon just in case if he goes in with his skeleton giant okay so he is going in with his uh, archer queen again here i will fireball and now i can take out his archer queen with a log and uh, here i'm using my log and then i will put down my skeleton giant take out his okay here i want to support this skeleton giant with hog but uh, i will wait guys and here I will go in with my hog after filling the elixir okay so many of you guys must have completed this challenge already okay so I'm going in with my hog okay he also have mirror so he mirrored his uh, skeleton army and here I will put down my musky I don't know why he zapped there I think he was trying to zap musky or I think he was trying to predict something so here I will fireball his uh, Archer Queen and then I will wait for log now I will use my log okay so he used his bats to distract okay now here I will put down my skeleton giant and can and I think I can log and take out his uh, Archer Queen till now the match is uh, quite smooth guys and uh, I want to go in with my hog here Okay, so I will go in with my hog and uh, he used his skeleton giant. Now he will gonna get a good counter push and uh, first I will distract his uh, skeleton giant and then I will put down another cannon. I wanted to ask you guys one thing that uh, how you guys are feeling about the balance of weight guys uh, as it's good or not as I'm very much sad for the log uh, nerf as uh, log is not gonna deal that much damage which it used to deal so comment down below guys what are your thoughts about the balance update so here we both put down our skeleton giant at the back so now i think they are not gonna cross the bridge and here i just wasted my electro spirit okay so here i will put down my skelly to distract his uh, skeleton giant so he is pushing with his skeleton giant from the opposite lane and I will use my skeleton giant to defend his. Okay so his archer queen is coming from that side and I think his archer queen will be taken out by the giant skeleton bomb. Here I will log to predict his uh, skeletons but uh, he didn't use his skeleton army. Okay so here I will put down my skeleton giant just to distract his skeleton army and his giant skeleton. Okay, so now I'm going in with my hog. Okay, let's see what we will use. Here I will fireball and log his archer queen. And our hog will get one shot, which is great. And now I will put down another musky. I just need two more fireballs to finish the match. And here he used his skeleton army and he cloned it. I don't know why. Okay, so I just need one more log to finish the match. Here I will defend it and then I will use a log. Okay, so GG's to him. GG's to French monster. Uh, so, uh, how was the match guys? Please comment down below. And uh, what are you guys using in this challenge? Comment down below. I want to know that which kind of deck you guys are using. Okay, so I just need one more match to finish off the challenge. So, I'm going in. So, here I'm in a match against Nico Tina batman friends okay so nicotina good luck and now he is uh, just spamming his electro spirit at the bridge and i will use my log he also have skellies i don't think it's a mirror match guys okay so he have log as well and he also have fisherman so fisherman is a quite skillful card i think uh, using fisherman needs a lot of skill what do you guys think please comment down below he also have Nido, 
I don't know why he have Nero and Fisherman in the same deck. So our Hog got one shot, which is great, and he is giving out a lot of emote guys. He is spamming Goblin, Hog, and uh, Hog Rider emote. So I will put down my cannon just in case if he have Royal Giant or if he have something. I think he is playing some kind of uh, cycle deck as you can see that he have two spirits in his deck and uh, uh, maybe he is trying to cycle his rage the skeleton giant over to the tower okay so he got the king tower activation it's okay guys so here i will go in with my hog and musky and musky will be locked on to his tower so here i will put down my skeleton giant to take out his okay so let's see what he will do he is gonna pull my skeleton to the opposite lane and i think his skeleton giant will get a connection okay so i'm starting to getting it guys as you can see that what he is trying to do is uh, he is gonna pull whatever the troops or whatever the uh, thing which we are using to distract skeleton giant and he will make sure that his skeleton giant will reach to the tower here i will fireball his uh, zappies and we will get a good value and now i will wait and see what he will do now let's see guys how the match will go okay so i'm using my log and then i will go in with my hog on his weak side tower okay so he used his uh, fisherman and fisherman will pull my hog and i think hog will not get any shot but i will fireball his uh, zappies and here fisherman will get a lock and i think uh, it will get some damage and here i will use my hog to get some damage and i think our hog will get two shots which is great guys so now i just need one log and fireball to finish the match and this is it guys ggs to him ggs to nicotina so we are in the last second of the match and here i will put down my cannon for his skeleton giant so what do you guys think that how is this challenge comment down below and uh, do you like the emote or not as uh, the emote is quite good as it's uh, of the skeleton emote and it's like kind of a dancing so you can see that this is the emote which we are getting guys let me show you the emote here so this is the emote which we are getting in the challenge so this is it guys hope you guys enjoyed the video hit the like button if you like the video subscribe to the channel for more such content and see you in the next video bye bye